Good morning and welcome to the first day of a brand new week on. Now I'm not going to do a diet per se this week, but I am going to try something which has uh, risen in popularity during this pandemic that we currently see ourselves living in the midst of, and that is Amazon Prime Now. Now I had heard of Amazon Fresh, which is basically Amazon's answer to Tesco delivery or Asda delivery, etc, etc, except there is a sort of second offshoot to that, which is Amazon Prime Now, which is food delivered, well, now, not really now, with, with Amazon Fresh, you get things delivered in the future. But with Amazon Prime Now, you get it delivered now. And it comes from supermarkets like Morrison's. And theoretically, I should be able to get it within the next few hours. So, that's all I'm going to eat this week. Things that I can get off Amazon Prime Now from my local Morrison's store. That should be interesting. Now, they have only just started offering chilled food. To help, and otherwise, I would have done this a while ago, but no one wants to live off pasta during this pandemic. Actually, apparently a lot of people want to live off pasta during this pandemic, considering at the start of it, that's all people bought. That and toilet roll. Not sure how you're going to survive very long on that. Uh, I guess eating so much pasta gives you the shits or something. But let's dive right in. Let's see what Amazon Prime now has to offer. Right, let's dive in. Yeah, some nice breakfast items. Yum yum. Some nice things for lunch. And some nice dinners. <laughs> How about a couple of cheeky snacks as well? Just a couple of cheeky snacks. And finally, that moody little panther that lives in our house needs something to eat as well. So I suppose it's only fair that he gets something because, you know, even though he does live here rent free, little scrounger, that time he got a job. That should do us a couple of days, so there's 15 items in there. I shall not be going hungry. So these items, these 15 items, wow, it isn't cheap. It, 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 it isn't cheap. Um, so there is a minimum basket of £15, almost doubled that on just a couple of days worth of items. Um, I would be interesting to know how much this would cost if I were just to uh, actually go in to Morrison's or do it sort of uh, via Sainsbury's or, or, or Tesco or something like that. But, mm, I mean, it does, that, that does include three ninety nine. but still. But I suppose you are paying for the convenience, aren't you? Uh, okay, begrudgingly. Well, it's currently 9.57am and the, uh, the delivery slots <laughs> seem to be um, two hour windows and the earliest being four o'clock. So it looks like I'm going hungry today. I'm going to have a very late lunch and no breakfast today. But, uh, oh well, what you, what you, in fact, actually, what, what is that? No, so, yeah, the earlier ones, no, you can forget it. You can forget having breakfast today, me. You, you're not, you know that, okay, I better select that before it bloody goes. Yeah, so, 28.25. Superb. <sighs> I'm already hungry. Double check my items, and I've requested that there be no substitutions if something isn't available, and my... Oh, okay, then the, the 3.99 has been added on, so 32.24. <gasps> this is going to be an expensive week on. An expensive but convenient week on. Okay. Buy it now. Thanks, Michael. Your Morrison's order is being prepared. Am I in trouble with this website? Because nobody calls me Michael unless I'm in trouble. So there it is, currently sat in the Milton Keynes Morrison store. Hopefully on the shelves, waiting to be thrown into a bag and brought to my house between four and six. I'm going to be very grumpy today. Well, there we go. Nice and easy to place the order. Um, I'm a little bit surprised that it's going to be between four and six. Um, but then again, I mean, full disclosure, I have used Amazon Prime now before, but that was before they offered chilled items. And um, I'm guessing now that they do offer chilled items, they're a lot more popular because it's not been quite that long a wait when I have used it in the past. So we'll see. Hopefully it comes at four and not at six, because then I'll be having my uh, lunch and my dinner at the same time. Is it too early for me to moan about being hungry yet? Basil isn't happy because the fan's going because it's very warm. And you're molting everywhere, aren't you? Hmm? You've just been talking like nobody's business and now you just shut up. 
There we go. What's up? I've ordered you some. So, uh, you got some food on the way. Some Amazon Prime Now food. Are you happy? Are you going to keep turning your face away? You are so rude. Yes. Well, while I wait for my food to come, I suppose it's only right for me to jump on the old scales. Now, just remember, before I do this, it has been a long lockdown, okay? So, just, just don't judge. So there we go. That's what we're looking at. This is not a, a weight loss week on. This is just to see what we can get and how things are. But I suppose we have to keep up the traditions. Well, it's approaching lunchtime and you guessed it. I'm getting hungry, but I am currently editing a video essay for my second channel, Film Thoughts. And the title of this video, I'm not 100% decided, but by the time this week on actually hits, um, I'm guessing it will have been uploaded, but uh, it'll be something along the lines of Why Tremors 2 is the greatest sequel of all time. That's right, not clickbait, because I genuinely think it is. Because it's bloody brilliant. So check out that video on Film Thought. I'll stick the, uh, the links in the description, I suppose, and give that other channel a subscribe if you'd be so kindly. Because I'm very hangry right now. No breakfast. Just air. <laughs> And not even the roller coaster that used to be at Alton Towers, which is not even my good ride, really, even though it's now collected going to add VR, but now they're taking VR away because everyone's realised that VR's a wasted gimmick in theme parks. Oh my god, they spent so much money on the Darren Brown ride at Thor Park, which just relies on VR and it's just a monumental failure. But there we go, I'm not here to talk about theme parks in this video. Or tremors. I'm here to moan about food. I'm hangry. Ooh, a text from Amazon. Your Prime Now shopper started working on your order. We'll let you know if there are any changes. <gasps> I'm excited and I'm also absolutely famished. <laughs> because it is currently four minutes past three. I need some food. So there's my food, currently still in Milton Keynes. And I have the option to chat to the person who's doing my order. Brilliant. <laughs> well, shall, shall I ask him about his day? Shall I ask him how he's going? How's he doing? You're right, mate. I've just got a text. One of my items is out of stock. And look, it's appeared in the chat window. Do I want the replacement? Goujons instead of fried chicken. Well, that's my dinner tonight, so I'll accept that. Is it cheaper? I don't know. But I'm getting my goujons. Get my goujons. There's another one. Another one. Do I want a uh, out-of-stock double-decker burger for a deluxe with bacon and cheese? You had me at bacon and cheese. Although I've got to admit, a little bit miffed that uh, a bunch of my items aren't actually there. But, you know, if they're not on the shelf, they're not on the shelf. This is a pretty good way of doing the substitutes, to be fair. Not like Tesco, or just like, oh, sorry, your chocolate bar's not in stock, so here's a whole raw chicken. Hopefully that's my last te text on saying that though, because all the good stuff uh, is, isn't isn't there by the sounds of it. <laughs> Ooh, the shop has finished. I'm excited. Too bad it's still in Milton Keynes. Move away. Move away. Move away from that. 20 to 6. Still in Milton Keynes. It's nearly, nearly 6 o'clock. Where's our stick? Oh my god, it's with us soon! Well, Grace cooks her dinner, and it smells good, even though it's just broccoli. Here's my Prime Now order. Three big old bags full of stuff. Ooh, what's this? Cool packs. They are certainly cool packs. Right, let's get this all unloaded and check out the goodies. I mean, that's not really a goodie, is it? And here we go, my nice looking food for the next few days. Some breakfast stuff in there, 
some stuff for sandwiches, some bread, some sweet potato fries, and there's my substituted bread and chicken goujon, and there's a thousand of them, and I can't wait to tuck into that while you have your broccoli. And chicken. And chicken. Is, it even, is that even on? Yes, you can hear it, Super low. And I've got some hot dogs in a can there for a video, which may or may not be on the channel right now, but check it out if it is. Check it out in a bit if it isn't. Right, I am very hungry, so it's time for me to make some scram. Oven is on and warming up because I'm definitely going to tuck into these breaded chicken goujons with sweet potato fries. They look very nice. I would have preferred the southern fried chicken, so I'll see what I can get on a, a later delivery in the week. You've got, what's that? Teriyaki? Teriyaki chicken. And uh, broccoli. And, and rice. rice. Ah, okay, mixing it up. And uh, yeah, I'm going to get this in the oven because I am famished. I don't know if I've mentioned that. Have I mentioned that? I don't yes. think I've, no, I haven't. I feel really spongy, really hollow. <laughs> it's, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm going to put lots on. I'm going to get lots of comments calling me fat, big, fat, fatty, but that's fine because. Bloody hell, how much I am. Shut on? up, don't you start. Here we go. It's ready. Ah, steam. I'm very sorry. Let's get it out. Get it dished up. Yeah. Perry Perry mate, now you come on, there's only some drinks left. Right. You enjoying your lolly there? Yes, yeah, thank you. Let's try a goujon. Mm. Is it nice? Not bad. Is there a lot of meat in there? It tastes like cheap meat. It tastes like the turkey dinosaur kind of chicken. That's nice. Yeah, and there's a bit of um, pepperiness, I think. Mm. I've been waiting for this all day. Mm. Let's try a chip. Oh, sweet potato. Mm. Sweet potato fries. Really crispy. Usually it's quite difficult to get a nice crisp on a chip in the oven. But these are good. Mm. Loads of flavour in that, they are delicious. I am going to get scurvy for the lack of veggies, but I'm going to enjoy myself whilst I uh, slowly die, so that's good. Mm. Well, as you can see, empty plate. That was delicious. I am very happy, although still unhappy at the fact that I had to wait a long time but that's not really Amazon's fault that's just my fault for not doing it sooner but now it is time to watch a bit of football on the telly because football's back and Grace is playing with Basil well as much as Basil will play anyway it's not a lazy form of play Whoop. there may just still be a little hole that needs filling in my belly that is don't don't go there a little tonics caramel bar, which everyone remembers from their childhood, but no one seems to buy anymore. Mm. Caramel, chocolate, wafer, it's chewy, it's sticky, it's lovely. <laughs> oh, there we go, it's good to be doing that again. That was the first day of a week on Amazon Prime Now. And it wasn't so much now, um, it was what, before 10 and I couldn't get a delivery slot until four to six and it came literally with 10 minutes to spare. I'm not gonna complain about that because you know it was on time. Um, it, I really like the way that you can choose your own substitutions like in real time because Tesco don't allow that. Although I can't imagine if I'd have said no to that substitution he would have offered an alternative. So I don't know if that's something they can do in the future but that's me just really being picky because to offer that service in the first place is really bloody good. Um, the selection of food now that the chilled items are available is is really really great. It's not as full as uh, I would be just ordering off the Morrison's website but then at the same time I wouldn't be able to um, to have it the same day. I mean during this pandemic you've been lucky to get a slot so I imagine for a lot of people Amazon Prime now has been a, a little bit of a godsend, but not that they'd have been able to get you toilet paper and pasta at the start of this thing. But as things are now, 
pretty impressed. It's uh, it is more expensive, but you're paying for the convenience of uh, getting it within six hours, so that's all good. And it's my own fault today that I went without breakfast and lunch. So lesson learned for later in the week. So if you want to see how I get on for the remainder of this week, please do subscribe to the channel destroy that like button and do consider supporting the show on Patreon because it really does help to keep the show going. Things are going to be back in the swing of things on this channel. And also do check out my second channel, Film Thought, for some video essays and general filmy stuff. I've got lots planned and a new video series uh, that I'm not quite going to spill the beans on yet, but I'm really looking forward to making that one. And also, I'm going to start doing Twitch because Twitch is fun and games and stuff. Yeah, so thank you very much for tuning in on this, the first day of a week on Amazon Prime Now. Hashtag not spawn. But I'm looking forward to it because chicken and chips for dinner can't go wrong. Little, uh, little wafer as well for pudding. Delicious. So, thanks for watching. I'll see you for day two.